There was some news from your office today uh, that was announced by a, a statement uh, report in the press about a diagnosis you recently received of a serious but treatable form of cancer, a lymphoma. Um, when did you get this diagnosis? How are you feeling and how are the next few months looking for you? Well, I've had a battery of tests over the last several days, and it uh, it looks like it's 100 percent certain now that I do have this uh, large B-cell uh, lymphoma, which is a non-Hodgkin's lymphoma, as I understand it. It's very serious, and it's aggressive. Uh, but the great news is that because of all of the investments we've been making in uh, medical research and science and uh, technology, that it's very treatable. Um, and we're getting it early enough that uh, if I take well to the chemotherapy, which starts this week, um, and I go through all of my uh, six sessions, then I'll be in good shape. Um, and uh, I'm very grateful and thankful for that. Um, and I have an amazing staff and great constituents and a loving family and friends. And so it is totally my plan, Chris, to make it through this thing. Well, uh, we are, of course, uh, rooting for you and sending your best. And I just want to say this time of year, um, you know, you've, you've written incredibly movingly about your son, Tommy, you lost uh, just about two years ago. Um, and he's in our thoughts as well uh, on all the people out there this time of year battling depression, uh, we're thinking of them as well. And I know uh, it's something that's front of mind for you. So um, we're all pulling for you. And thank you so much for, for, for taking time, Congressman. Really, really means a lot. It was a wonderful being with you.